Hello, hello. Well, the captions worked immediately. What a surprise. Hello, how's it going? Happy afternoon or evening or nighttime or morning. Good time zone to you. I hope you're doing well. I'm actually going to start a new game today. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? Um, it's going to be extra loud when I open it. Let me tell you. Because it does not give you the option to um, change the volume immediately. So maybe I can like just like mute. I'm just going to mute the main audio for a moment. Oh my god, it's so loud in my ears. It's so loud. I'm saving you the trouble. I don't know how far in it lets me change the options, but I need to see. Oh my sweet baby Jesus. When I tell you it's loud, I literally mean it's like blasting in the ears. Hold up. Let me, um, Jesus, main audio is already at like 50%. Let's do like 30%. I wonder if I can, um... I have to have my volume, the headset. At like 10. Hold up. Let me. Let me. Yeah. What if I do this? And I do this. Is that gonna be. <laughs> Is that gonna be better? Let me put this back at 50. Just until I can change the volume. Okay, but I need to figure out if this controller will work. Could I have connected these beforehand? Probably. I got it. Maybe. Maybe not. I thought for a moment that it would. Um. Okay. I think I have, do. I have to use this. Ah, okay, okay. We're good, we're good. I was trying to use the analog stick to go up and down, but no. That's not how it works, apparently. Apparently. Alright, so I'm gonna start Nino Kuni, Wrath of the White Witch, remastered. And guess what? I might stream later tonight and do a different witch game. <laughs> because Little Witch in the Woods came out, and I just, oh, I really want to play it. I really want to play that game. Um, easy battles be easier recommended for players who prefer to focus on the story or normal. 
Honestly, I just want to focus on the story, so. We'll just go with easy. No shame in that, okay? No shame in that. Believe it or not, I'm not playing this game for a challenge. The art style makes me happy. <gasps> George! Call me stinky! Huh? 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 Web, hello, how are you? Um... Let me know if the volume's okay. Because I can't tell. It's just ridiculously loud for me. Why you call me stinky? Hey, wait for me. <laughs> Got him. Your world. That's right. Why isn't your this bitch is empty? Yeet going off. I'm so excited for this. Your name's different, but... Oh god. I oh, I could pause it. Hold up. I have to fix this now. But I don't remember what it was under. <laughs> um. Events? Ah, you, you were correct. You are correct. Here. This is empty. empty. Yeet! <laughs> there, I did it. Okay, okay. Continue. I love the music already. I'm excited to play this, and I'm excited to play Little Witch in the Woods. I'm excited to be ass at this game. It's been a long time since I think I've started like a new story-driven game. Like I've played games with story, but like they're not like main like Stardew. You're not really playing that for the story, mostly. Destiny doesn't count. Because it's not a pure story game. If you can hear my fan... Did you finish your last story-driven game? <laughs> Probably not. Um, actually... Actually... What was my last story-driven game? <laughs> That's the question. I finished Firewatch. I finished The Magnificent Truffle Pigs. Uh, that's all I remember at the moment. <laughs> I'm not very good at finishing games. <laughs> I finished Cat Quest 1 and 2. Ooh, I love this. Let me know if I need to up morning, the volume. Why, good morning, Oliver. It's like I'm watching a movie. Oh, I almost forgot. Did Philip find you? He said he had something to show you, dude. Really? So he finally finished it, huh? Do you know where he is right now? He just stepped out with some deliveries for me. I doubt he'll have gotten far. Thanks, Miss Layla. Oh, say hi to your mother for me. Those games are older than you? Hey. Firewatch? No. Over here. Who are you? It's Phil. 
I don't want to talk to you, Phil. I want some Idaho potatoes. Use the analog to walk over. Approach and you press A to speak. Oh god, I don't know the freaking Xbox controller. Alright. You can't... You can't tell me to press something and me know what it is. She's finally ready. Who? So what? What else would it be, dum dum? Boy, you are something else, Phil. So what do we do now? What else? We take your first spin tonight. Is, is it? Is, is this a vehicle? Like, what are we taking for a spin? Sorry, I was putting my jacket on. Tonight, but I can't. I mean, I need to ask my mom. And... Sure, sure. You go ask your mom. And then when do we do it, huh? Tomorrow? Next year? Well, I... No, but... Okay, we'll do it tonight. Yeah, Oliver, don't we'll be little... To be real quiet. Bitch. <laughs> sure we will. He's just a child. <laughs> He's just a child. Okay, tonight, my garage. Be there or be square. Sure. What's wrong with being square, huh? What's wrong so... with it? So says the crystal ball, your radiance. Hmm. The dark djinn's power alone will not suffice. Who are we taking for a spin? Yeah, who? What? what? Oliver, your radiance. Oliver? Why are you being a creeper and watching this child? The minimap will be displayed at the top right of the screen as you travel around. This map lets you see your immediate surroundings. George, did you work today? Press the right button to switch to the local map, showing an overview of the whole town. Star lets you see where you need to go next. Your first port of call is Oliver's house. So this button is the map. This button is the pause. What's this button? That button shows the map or not. Okay. I'm about to get ran over by a car. So Oliver's house is the star. You can't be running in the streets, kid. Okay. I would have dropped the milk, to be honest. Who are you? I heard from my boyfriend that Philip has been secretly working away at something. I know it's good for you youngsters to have your hobbies, but don't go causing trouble now, you hear? You're at work right now? Really? Oh, are you on lunch? Is there anything in the mailbox? I'm home! Hey, Mom. I got the groceries. Thanks, sweetie. Just pop them on the table, will you? Say, Mom, hmm? did you say something, sweetie? Um, you're kind of busy tomorrow, huh? Well, now that you mention it, I do have to practice for my concert in the morning. Oh, yeah? So, you'll be in bed kind of early. Huh? See, how's work going? Uh, yes, I suppose I will. Oh, you will, huh? <laughs> will you stop being so mysterious and eat your breakfast? You'll be it's morning soon. time? You made him go get groceries before school? Thanks for breakfast, Mom. You ate that so quick. See you later, Mom. Bye. Bye, sweetie. You be good now. Or don't be good. I will. Hey, Bill. You didn't go to school yet? Ha! School schmool. Today's a special day, kiddo. Today's the day our dream machine finally rolls off the drawing board and onto the streets of Motorville. Busy as fuck? You been going in on your day off? No! But why? Oh boy, I can't wait. When can I see it? Whoa there, cowboy. Not so loud. Don't forget this is our secret. Hey, dum-dum. You didn't tell your mom about it, did you? 
no, I did not. I asked her if she was busy, and she said she has a concert practice, so she'll be in bed real early. Perfect. Then tonight's the night. You still in, kiddo? How old are you to be calling me kiddo? Sure I am. Tonight at your garage. I'll be there. How how much older are you than Oliver to be calling him a kiddo? She must be asleep by now. <laughs> Shmoney. Shmoney. Oh, I'm surprised captions know how to spell that. Neato. She's out like a light. Now's my chance. I have to get to Phil's garage. Press Y to open main menu. You will then be presented with a range of options. Use up, down, left, right to select option. Press A. Have chosen the option. You can return to the main menu. Open the main menu and press... You can now use main menu. Settings. Haha. -ha. We're gonna bum, 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 bum. and then maybe turn the music down a smidge. And we'll see how that goes, if that's good. And then come over here and I can put this back. whatever subtitles on is that is that too loud and this button to save sneaking out after dark You'd have to be walking a lot slower for you to not hear. You're telling me your mother did not hear that? So I gotta go dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. Can I go this way? No. Hello, my lady. What are you doing out so late? Why, good evening, Oliver. What are you doing out so late? I'm asking you that question. Why? What are y'all doing? Uh, hi. There's nobody around. But this is Motorville. I guess you'll be okay. I mean, I guess. You think I'll be okay? I'm going down this scary oh, freaking alley. I love the cutscenes. Already, like, I love them. You gotta be so mean. What is it with that kid? What kept you, Slowpoke? Sorry, my mom just wouldn't go to bed. So, is it finished? Sure is. The last bearing's in, and she's primed for action. Wanna see? Do I ever? All right. Is it a bike? Here goes nothing. Okay. Whoa. Oh, is it is a vehicle. Oh, this is so, so neat. You betcha. <laughs> the new Coupe Deluxe ain't got nothing on us, Ollie. It's not even close. So, you ready to hit the road, kiddo? Yeah! <laughs> You're acting like nobody's gonna hear you driving this thing. Okay, there's nobody around. We should take her outside now. So, uh, Phil, who gets to drive first? Huh? Hmm, let me see now. Tell you what, kiddo. If you run down the street and make sure the coast is clear, I'll let you go first. You mean that? Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, wait right here. That's a lie. Watch out for Starry Mary, will ya? Starry Mary? You know, the girl who was spying on us before. I swear the kid is cracked. You're talking about her? Her window's open. There's no way she cannot hear you right now, okay? You're literally talking crap about her and her window's open. And she's literally staring at you. See? There she is again. I'll bet that tattletale goes straight to her olds. She wouldn't do that. What are you, sweet honor or something? Go check out front already. 
Sure thing, Phil. I'll be right back. Leave her alone. Check that the coast is clear. All right. The coast is clear. I better go tell Phil. Don't go. What? Huh? It's Who the? Bad. Please, Oliver. Don't go. Huh? Who are you? How do you know my name? Ollie! What's taking you so long? I'm sorry, Phil. Someone saw me. Oh, man. Who was it? Oh, uh, that girl over. Huh? What are you talking about? Huh? There's nobody there. Huh? That's weird. She was right there. A girl. A girl, huh? Mm hmm. I bet it was that dumb, scary Mary. Oh, no. Couldn't be. She's not allowed out. You must be going. What's wrong with her? Okay. Oh, oh, okay. <sighs> Oliver, the boy who will save the world. But unfortunately for him, his light is yet a mere candle in the blackness. Indeed. He may be the child the prophecies speak of, but he is a child nonetheless. Yet the boy who lived come to die. Did the other's darkness not engulf the land? I want to see what this lady looks like. English! I know, Llama. I, I was going to pick Japanese, but then I was like, you know, if anybody wants to, like, lurk and just have it as background sounds, then I'll just stick it in English for now, you know. I know. How are you? He who would save this doomed world must die. She looks dope. Mom, help me! <gasps> You're gonna kill this child? You're really gonna try and kill this child? He's a child. You're over here like, this boy must die. Sweetie? That is a child. Where are you? Oliver? Oliver? <laughs> yes, no more children. Scared, scared. <laughs> Llama, how are you doing? Um, you're kind of busy tomorrow, huh? Well, now that you mention it, I do have to practice for my concert in the morning. Oh, yeah? So, you'll be in bed kind of early, huh? <gasps> Oliver. Yeah, your son snuck out. Oliver. You're going the wrong way. I mean, you know, shouldn't you think, hey, Oliver has friends. Let me go check their house. Let me go check if my son is with his friends in the middle of the night. Oh, this kid's gonna crash. God, I bet it smells bad. How does this child know how to drive? Oh, sweet baby Jesus. Yep, yep, yep. Yep. <laughs> Yep. This poor kid can't swim. Oh. 
<laughs> Should I be laughing? <laughs> Oliver, I feel bad. Oliver, wake up. Uh, uh, Mom? Oh, sweetie, I'm so glad you're okay. You are alive? Good, I'm good. Sorry, I'm sorry. I swear, if I'd known, I never would have. Don't be silly, Phil. What about your car? That hunk could <laughs> Fortunately, so is the children's. I think you two have had excitement for one day. You're telling me this mother's not very upset? Are you okay, Phil? I saw twisting my ankle back there. Whatever will you children get up to next? Is the mother about to die? Are you okay? Mom? What's wrong? Oh my always did have a weak heart. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, she ain't sweetie. dead. Oh, sweetie. Mom. The volume okay? difference between cutscenes and the game is I just you wild. Be good now. For me. Did you get good sleep, Slama? Did she die? Is she dying? <gasps> Mom. <laughs> Mom. No. No. Don't leave me. I shouldn't I shouldn't be laughing. Yeah. Oh. This is your fault, kid. If you hadn't gone out there, <laughs> she would have had to go after you. If she has a weak heart. <laughs> Sacrificing herself to save her child. <laughs> I'm a horrible person. Of course. But shorn of his mother's love, to whom can he now turn for guidance? <laughs> That's depressing, though. <laughs> but so awkward. Our powers are strongest. Very good, your radiance. What the fuck have I walked in on? <laughs> um, this kid. <laughs> <laughs> this kid mom just died because she so he went out with his friend to like ride a vehicle and then he ended up like crashing into the water and this kid can't swim so his mom went after him and saved him and apparently she has a weak heart now she's dead <laughs> she's dead <laughs> Look at that cat. <laughs> Hello, Exo. Oh, Jesus Christ, what a way to start a game. Right? I feel bad for laughing, but like it's so awkward. <laughs> you named your cat Timmy Toldrum? He's been in there three whole days now. He's a selfish brat and got his mom killed. <laughs> Hello! Are you going to school? Mommy starts her new job today, but she's asked someone very special to take care of you. Mommy spent a long time making him. I'm sure he'll look after you very well. It's like the other bird. Be good while Mommy's away, okay? You're there now. I hope you have a great day. Is something wrong, sweetie? At the ripe old time of 7.35 a.m. So, <laughs> sounds like a blast. What time does your class start? This poor kid is literally alone. Ew! Ew! Oh. <laughs> huh? What just happened? Just what you expect from the ultimate manifestation of evil. Lord High, uh, Lord of the Fairies. Um, Lord of the Fairies. Who? What are you deaf or something? Drippy, Lord High, Lord of the Fairies. I said, didn't I? Drippy. 
That's right, and I'm sick to the teeth of you were snivelling and moaning. A proper crybaby bunt in you are. Three days, man. I mean, I've been sad before, but crying for three old days? I'm surprised there's a drop of water left in you. You're a big boy, man. Three days is... What? Well, <laughs> huh? I, uh... Oh, dear, a bit flummoxed, a wee bit lost. Did you guys steal his food? Don't worry, man. I got all the answers. Oh, but uh, prepare yourself. Explaining all this is going to take a while. Ready? <laughs> Kill him, Drippy! Uh -huh. <laughs> Tidy. I like your style. Very honest, anyway. Stay that way, okay? Irish! How are you? On with the show! Uh, okay. See, it's like this, see? What it is, is there's more worlds out there than this one by Earth. There's what you might call parallel worlds, see? They're like worlds A multiverse. the side of you are one. And one of those worlds is my world. That's right, the whole nother world. Another world? The multiverse. You are. And I, that is the Lord High Lord of the Fairies. The reason I'm by her in this world of viewers, well, it's because there's a proper bad apple trying to upset the peace of both our worlds, see? Shada, the dark jinn, his name is. And what he did was he took over people's hearts and spread war and ruin all over our world. Tried to stand up to him, I did. And he turned me into a flipping doll and kicked me out of our world and into you as the rotter. <laughs> I like this one. <laughs> and then you went and cried all over me and poof. The curse was lifted, just like that. Which makes me think you must be the one we fairies call the pure-hearted one. The one the legends say will save our world. Just goes to show you can't judge a book by its cover, <laughs> huh? So, anyway, that means I better get you over to our world. You have to work on your thesis? Ah. All right with you. How's your thesis going? I'm good, how are you? Is the sound okay? Do I need to adjust it more? with me to help you. But I... Can you hear me over the oh, game? Oh, want me to ask properly, <laughs> do you, fair dues? What? Because I can't hear oh, myself. You are hearted one. Will you please come and save our world? I... Um... No. I could, like, he couldn't even save his mom. Sorry, I must have misheard you. What did you say? <laughs> Go on, Kid couldn't save his mom and dad. Literally I lava. Literally. I, I mean... <laughs> I can't do it. This is why they say never work with children. I ask nicely and you give me a hearty yes, sir. That's how this works, see? Gee whiz, that would be swell, you say. It's just that these things are done. It's tradition. How am I supposed to work with this? It's like he's never read a story in his life. But I don't know anything about your world. And I just can't right now. You're dying inside, your DNA's not working with a certain reaction, and you're trying to fix it? Oh god. What? Is it hard to fix? <gasps> you you're just gonna come out and sit there. <laughs> Uh, Hurry up, I like this character. Uh, okay. <laughs> I like him. Let's see now. Blimey. It can't be. But then it can't be a coincidence, neither. What is it? The great sage Alicia. Then we might just be able to save you, ma'am. Huh? She died. What are you talking about? You ready for another year full? Yeah. The souls of people in your world and my world are connected, which means people from over by you have another version of themselves ah, over by the there, multiverse. called a soulmate, <laughs> see? And people with soulmates can even look like each other. Now, you a ma'am, well, she shared a soul with the great sage Alicia. A oh, proper she talent dope. she was. Huh? So my mom was a sage? But how does that help us save her? Well, Alicia tried to take on the Dark Jinn, but his power was too much for her, and he trapped her in this dark jewel called the Soul Snare. When that happened, then the link between hers and you and Mam's souls would have been cut off. But if you could free Alicia, it just might fix the link, and who knows, it might even bring your mom back. Absolutely no way is it going to bring sure his mom back. But it's possible, yeah. Wait. That's not how it works. How do you know all this, Mr. Drippy? You've been a dog I'm hard to so fix things, so I just start all over. Ugh, do you have to get ah, more samples? No, more snails? It's like this, see? I'm not the only fairy. Even though I was stuck by you, my buddies were keeping me abreast of all the goings on over there. How? I suppose it's what you might call telepathy. And that's not all. I was sending my lordly orders back over there, too. Having them spy on Shaddaa and that, you know, tidy, huh? Hmm? What is it? I'll... I'll do it. I'll come to your world. Bring the mom back, sacrifice the kid. I'll come with you and save my mom. <laughs> oh, oh that's or something. <laughs> you might be doing it for all the wrong reasons. Irish, how are you doing? World, I won't look a gift are you at work? Mouth. Tidy. We better get going then. Chop, chop. Chop, okay. chop. But 
How do we get to your world? Oh, curious, are we? All right, I'll tell you. First thing we need is a drop of magic. Go and have a dig around in the fireplace. There's something hidden there so nosy parkers won't find it. But why would anybody hide something in there? That's for me to know and you to find out. Look lightly. I fucking hate that phrase. I, I hate that phrase. Because if I ask somebody, hey, what are we going to do? Hey, what, what, blah, 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 blah. And they respond with, that's for me to know and you to find out. I just want to, you know, I just, ugh, hate it. So in your first class assignment since you financially got approved. Hell yeah. You're off work today and tomorrow. Fuck yeah. What class are you taking? I'll need a small amount of tissue to extract DNA and I got a whole lot of snails. So I just need to extract from the same snail skin. Okay. Well, at least you don't have to get more. A spell book in the fireplace. Go and check it out. <laughs> I like the way that he walks around. <laughs> What could be hidden in a place like this? A mighty spell book. Huh? A book? <laughs> Quick, but light it while he's there. inside. <laughs> Not this book. The wizard's companion laughs in the face of fire. Wouldn't be much of a spell book if it didn't, now would it? Really? I'm gone. Aha, gotcha. Why, why is that just chilling there? How, <coughs> how is it this is convenient? This a spell book? That there is the wizard's companion, the fount of all wizarding knowledge. I don't know why I'm wizard's questioning companion. these things. Just like, you know, imagine you're just like cleaning out your fireplace and all of a sudden you just find a magical book. You're taking gross math and intro to nursing and intro to healthcare delivery. Ooh, I mean, besides the math, the rest of it sounds interesting. I would say fun. I don't know if it's fun, but interesting. You need to babysit. Why? Why? Now listen up. I'm going to teach you what's what in that wizard's companion of yours. If you want to have a read of it, press Y to open the main menu. You should see it down at the bottom right of there. Then you just need to choose it with A and you can leave through the wizard's companion to your heart's content. Take a minute or two to have a skim a few pages, eh? You look like a smart lad, so I'm sure you'll get into it. Ah, oh, I almost forgot. The first thing you have to do when you get your hands on the wizard's companion is to make a pledge. You need a vow that you will do all you can to be worthy of being a wizard. Don't look so flippin' worried. It's not hard. All you have to do is write your name in the book with an open, honest heart. And you don't even have to write Oliver if you don't want. You can write Bunting, Crybaby, or whatever you like. The important thing is that you mean it. Go on, scribble your name down. <gasps> this is, this is too, too much. This is too much power. Yeah, your name. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Nope. <laughs> Should I do? Should I do, bitch? Oh, that's dope. Oh, I wish I could fucking. Should we be cunt or bitch? <laughs> I'm getting my PhD. Hell yeah. Just wonder if I say yourself because that didn't make sense. Please ban me. No, I could never. Or should we just name him Oliver? Uh, here's the here's the choices, okay? Alright, how do we do this? Hold up. We're gonna we're gonna just Okay. Create a new poll. Name. We'll let it go for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Saki 
tits at McGee. <laughs> Sure, I'll just name it Saggy Tits McGee. <laughs> All right. How does this work? Cunt one. <laughs> And before I get banned off Twitch, just because I named something cunt. How do you write cunt in Japanese? Was that possible? Tempted to like... Is there... Is there... Listen. That's too... <laughs> oh my goodness. Mm. Mm. We'll just go a cunt. <laughs> Are you sure you're happy with the name cunt? <laughs> I'm a child. I forgot what I named my Pokemon person. What is it? You got a wand somewhere by here? We can't go casting spells without a wand. How am I supposed to know? A wand? Why would we have a wand? Oh, that's a pain. Ah, well, can't be helped. We just have to look for one outside. Huh? We won't find one out there either. Don't nitpick, crybaby Bunting. Bunting? My name is Oliver. Oh, ah, so the crybaby bit was right, at least was it. That's how kind of quick we needed. Hell yeah. Righto, time to find ourselves a magic wand. Had to take a drink of my water. Just get a stick. You mean there's one hidden somewhere around here? Like the spell book? Ha! You're having to laugh if you think I'm gonna make it that easy, man. What do you think I am? Made of wizarding equipment? Nah, this one's gonna be a little more difficult, but our journey over to my world is a hunt for the soul snare, among other things. So why don't you treat this as a warm-up? The Easter egg hunt before the wild goose chase, if you will. D, huh? Mm, okay, I, I guess. Okay, and Lang, the thing is, I never brought a wand with me. I mean, look at me. The price of my lovability is my small stature, ain't it? I only just managed to carry that flippin' book. Anymore, and I'd been crushed. So even fairies tell lies, huh? Of course they do. Us fairies are in English liars. I cannot speak today, okay? It's because I speak too fast. Anyway, no point in crying over spilled milk. Let's find ourselves a substitute, shall we? Cinder says hello. She just bonked her head into my shin. Really? One day I'll turn my camera back on and then you can see my cats. I have to go soon. I wish I could stay long, but I can't take my laptop. And listen here, Exo. That's okay. I appreciate you, okay? I hope you have a wonderful day when it's time for you to go. And I hope that the thesis just moves along well and you get what you need. All right. <laughs> Extract my DNA if needed. Ayo! DNA! Bam! Well, if you can find something brown and sticky, <laughs> like maybe a stick, <laughs> we might just be able to model through. Uh, okay, <laughs> you sure a stick will work? Do you think I'm sending you up the garden path or something? Fine, I'll give you a hand. Follow me, Bunting. Where are we going? Eh, what are you looking at? Don't tell me you're thinking of using this lamppost as a flipping wand. I think the stick he's looking for is on the front of that speeding car. <laughs> well, you can cut that out for a start. It's way too flippin' big. We need a stick or something like that, it? Why don't we go and have a look over by there? Okay. Okay. 
Um, I guarantee you nobody else can see this thing. This thing. Wow, well, look. <laughs> In front of this car. Literally subjecting snails to so much salt their DNA just comes out. Really? That's how it works? This is one proper tidy, proper tidy motor, eh? Might get myself one of these. This is not a stick. <clears throat> Sorry, now it's not really the time, is it? It's not a stick, it's a car. There ain't anything one like over here, over by here either. Let's go and look over the other side, shall we? Okay. Um, when you find something, don't forget to pop it in your bag for safekeeping. Look up at the top left of the main menu and you'll see your bottomless bag. And there you'll find all your items nicely sorted into different categories. There's handy. Use LBRB to shift between the categories. Of course, there ain't much to see at the moment, but when you've got a load of stuff, you'll be glad to glad you'll be glad of a bit of ordering it. Anyway, next time you pocket a tidy item, be sure and have a closer look at it in your bottomless bag. Put it in my bag, sure. In a nutshell, yeah, that's how it works. But I think that extraction method is no bueno for you. Really? What other method would there be? My bottomless bag. <gasps> Treats? Mm. Whoa. Whoa. That's dope. How do I go back? That's the main road that way. Okay. Yeah, I wonder if any of these old people are like, mm, this kid's talking to himself. Is he okay? He just went through a traumatic event. I'm just gonna throw myself in salt bath and watch the toilet flow. Aw, oh, yeah. Aw, oh, yeah. <sighs> it's no use. There's nothing around here that looks like a wand. You're not wrong, Bunting. All right, we better split up then. Broaden the search. Like, I'll go and take another quick look around your house. You stay by here and head up the outside search, okay? Uh, okay. Currently trying to kit to see if it works, but the problem with the salt is that all the salt snail salt ruins the DNA and makes it unusable for the stuff. Ah. Okay. Okay, brown and sticky, brown and sticky. You can literally just break a branch off of a tree. Oliver, huh? <gasps> oh, it's you. You're full of shit. <laughs> They're old people. They live long enough. Not that children are evil, before? therefore don't give two shits about mm -hmm. them. <laughs> we met before. We, so, how do you know who I am? I'm really, really sorry, Oliver. Huh? Your mummy. I'm sorry. I couldn't save her. That's not oh, your responsibility. Why would you be sorry for that? I wanted to save her. I really did. Huh? Hey, wait. Where are you going? Why would hey, that be your... Where did you go? Ollie boy, why are you talking to thin air? Mr. Drippy, she disappeared again. Huh? Who did? That strange girl. That's the second time she tried to talk to me. What's that? A girl? Where? You're right about strange. I can't see her any flipping where. Well, how could you? She disappeared into thin air. Well, anyway, there's something I want to ask you. There is? <laughs> Why does he look so uh, suspicious? Sure, go ahead. Do you mind it? You know, having a sidekick like. Huh? A sidekick? Who do you mean? Crikey, that's cold. Who do you mean, he says? <laughs> Stab me in the heart while you're at it. I mean me. I wanted to know if it was all right me joining you on your adventures. Or if you were maybe wanting to trade me in for a younger, prettier model. But it looks like I got my answer, huh? Well, so you know, if you don't have faith in people, you'll never see their true worth. And what's more? Look at this. Huh? It was on the ground, right where that girl was standing. Chuck it here then. Ta. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. It's a wand. <laughs> you mean it? A real wand? Come over by here and take a look, man. It might seem like any old stick, but it's got all magic writing on it. See? It does, huh? Wow. Is that how people write in your world? The runes are all faded, so it's Max like speed for ten minutes. You got a vortex machine? But I want to see that. For current purposes, it's a beauty. Nito. I want to see 
Luckier than you know, Ollie boy. Do I never thought we'd <laughs> just a gigantic vibrator? Oh, <laughs> Do you think maybe that girl brought it here for me? You obtained an old stick. Oh, the music's so cute. Right now, we need a place to cast our spell. To cast Gateway, you need somewhere proper massive. <laughs> While you're sitting on the vortex machine. <laughs> Quality checks, my dude. <laughs> oh my god. That would actually be hilarious. But also, I wonder how many people have actually, like, thought about attempting to do that. Hold up, wait a minute. Hold up, wait a minute. There we go. Victoria, the lab technician. You need space to give it oomph, see? Do we really need that much oomph? Oomph. Yeah, what kind of question is that? Magic is special, isn't it? It's sacred, right? <laughs> Let me go get my goggles on. Lab techs have needs too. <laughs> you have to cast spells I love y'all. environment possible. <laughs> and a mop. Bucket and a mop. That's some wet. Macaroni in a pot. That's some wet. Wop, wop, wop. <laughs> you really are new to this, are you? This is beginner stuff we're talking about here. Oh, uh, sorry. Now, take me somewhere with plenty of space. It's got to be somewhere around by you. Um, the town square, I guess. Town square we go. Bum, ba -da -dum, ba -ba -ba -bum. <laughs> Vortex apps. Oh, puppy! The sound he makes when he runs is very adorable. I appreciate it. Do you really think we should be doing this here? No worries, man. Normal people can't see magic, see? Go on, Ollie boy. Cast gateway. Um. Opens up a doorway that transports the caster between worlds. I get to be a magician! That's it, man! You got it! Uh... Whoa! Whoa! Oh my god, I am Leviosa. This kid cannot control his magic, okay? You see that? Amateur. You need to hold your hands steady. Tidy! <laughs> what a loser. Oh my god, the dog can see it! I can't even control magic. Imagine. Imagine not being a pro the moment you pick up the book. No, it's cunt. Hey, it's not bad work for a crybaby, this. <laughs> I want the dog to be the main character. You're gonna get a lantern and septum ring? Do it. And we're off to another world! Hey, wait! Wait for me! Sometimes I think about getting the top of my ears pierced, and then I think about it, and I'm like, mmm, I'm a... I'm a bit of a beach. The Lion King? I've seen this scene before. Let's get going, shall we? <laughs> Roast some marshmallows for a snack and shit? Hey, Imagine! So this is... your world. Ah, home at last! But there's a tidy way to go yet. Hey, Mr. Drippy, that was pretty neat just now, huh? Oh, that herd of elk! Enjoy your first encounter with the majestic wildlife of our mysterious world, did you? Uh-huh. What in the hell? Huh? Jeepers. Oh my god! Oh, oh my god, look at it! Where from? Oh. Ah. What do we 
do? Pet it. the big softies just now. He's itching for a fight. Proper savage. No, pet him. Pet him. Use that stick you got by there. Give him a whacking and send him packing. Look lively. He's making his move. Rough. Look at him, okay? <laughs> ah! <laughs> Don't fret, Ollie boy. Let your old pal Drippy talk you through the basics of battle. First off, take a look at that green gauge by there that shows your health points. The more health you have, the healthier you are, but if you run out, you go unconscious. See the blue one under that? That's your magic. Don't worry about magic for now. Let's talk about beasties first, shall we? Are we watching an anime? We are! We basically are, Holly. Hi. How are you? You can see lots of information about them up by here on the right. That's useful, eh? The red gauge shows you their health. Get that down to nothing and you've won. And these speech bubble thingies down by here are the commands you can use in battle. Well, that's enough to be going on with. Try giving the rotter a smack with your stick. Just use LTRT to select attack. Confirm your choice with A and Bob's your uncle. Right out. Get cracking with a whacking. You woke up from a nap. How was your nap? Nice. <laughs> Tidy. <laughs> Wait, I have a thing for this. Nice car. Perfect. <laughs> I also have this. Bye, Exa. Have a good day. <laughs> <laughs> it's just so funny to me. Nice car. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> How was your nap? That's what they say when you find an enemy's weak spot or block a big attack, see? Okay, so nice means you either blocked an attack or crit. Uh huh, like that, it's dropped something. You'd best pick it up, eh? So you make me laugh out loud in the middle of an open plan office? I'm sorry. Here, I want, here, would you like to see this one? Nobody asked! <laughs> They're putting up a fence in the backyard, so kind of loud. Oh. Can't do that yet. That's what's known as a glim, Ollie boy. Enemies drop them in the heat of battle. Green glims like that will restore health. Blue ones give you magic. You can also give your HP and MP a boost with spells and items. Of course, you'll just have to take my word for that. What with you not having any at the moment. Okie doke, that's enough for me. It's time for you to practice what I preach. Go on. Aw, hit me! <laughs> the sound it makes! Bye, Exo! <laughs> I like Drippy. What is it? I don't know. I like Drippy. I don't know what it is. It's a fairy. It's the high, Lord High, what some of the fairies. But I don't know what it is hey, specifically. Jeepers, nice creepers. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Our world is absolutely riddled with beasties. But keep that up and you'll have nothing to worry about. Right, let's get a move on, shall we? I wish I talked sure, like Mr. this. Dippy, but where are we going? Well, first off, we need to get you a wand. But I already have a wand. You're having a laugh, aren't you? That thing's about as magical as a flipping cabbage. You might just squeeze a gateway spell out of it, but you can forget about anything more than that. Honestly, I wish you'd think before you open your mouth. Oh, uh, sorry. Now, I told you Ding Dong Dell was just over by your <laughs> didn't I? Ding Dong Dell. Well, if we're very lucky, we might find a wand with a bit more oomph down by there. So... Is he Irish? He's really something. so hard to find here? Well, 
Time was you couldn't move for the I wish I sounded this cool. To be honest. Magic's taken a real nosedive. He banned people from using it, see? Cursed anyone who tried to. He scared them all so much they gave it up. So, he's pretty scary, huh? Well, he turned me into a flipping doll, didn't he's he? He's like an ugly cute. Just saying his name's enough to make most folks prick it. Still, I'd rather be a doll than have him go poking round in my heart. No one wants to be broken hearted. Broken hearted? Like, sad? Worse than that, much worse. It's when he steals a piece of a person's heart. So you're telling me he steals pe people's hearts. So he's Xehanort. And he's turning people into heartless. Poor beggars don't know whether they're alive or dead. That's no way to live, man. <laughs> so that's why they're all so scared of him, huh? We can't let him go on doing this. Kingdom Hearts? <laughs> it's not a matter of letting him, is it? It's not like people flipping enjoy it. That's why I brought you here, innit? You might just be able to stop him, see? And this kid... You really think I this, can? This, like, brown-haired yes, kid... You are the pure-hearted one! And the gets taken from his home into a different world, okay? The only difference is that Sora's mom is still alive. <laughs> Legends say that the pure-hearted one will drive away the darkness. We'll teach you a few tasty spells and you'll be ready to face him in no time. Sound good to you? Okay, I'll do it. I'll learn magic. Of course you will. And that's why we need to find you a better wand. All right. Let's head for Ding Dong Dell. So could we, like, Tidy. say that this is, like, um, I don't know, Donald Duck or something? <laughs> Ain't it beautiful, Ollie boy? It's good to be back. Our world is absolutely riddled with monsters. If one of them spots you, you'll see a big exclamation mark pop up over its head and it'll charge. When it gets within touching distance, you'll have a fight on your hands. If you run out of health in the middle of a battle, you'll be out for the count, so caref be careful. And here's a, little a tidy little technique for you. If you sneak up behind monsters without them noticing, you can get the first hit in, giving you the upper hand. The only thing is, it works the other way around, too. If a monster sneaks up on you, they'll be able to get the first hit in the rotters. Oh yeah, here. Here's just a little something. Consider it a gift from the Lord High Lord of the Fairies. Yeah, the Lord High Lord of the Fairies. That's who Drippy is. Three loaves of white bread. Uh, thanks. What do I do with these? Just have a munch on one when you're feeling a bit ropey and you'll be right as rain in no time, man. But a wizard cannot live by bread alone, all the boy. He needs proper wand and all, and that knobbly thing in your hand is doing my flipping head in. See that big castle to the north? That's Ding Dong Dell. That is. I reckon we'll find ourselves a wand by there, so let's get moving, shall we? Okay! Not even sourdough. Yeah, not even sour sourdough. You obtain a bunch of booster. I didn't see what it said, but I'm gonna fight you. Fight me! Fight me! Let's do it! Heh. <laughs> The poor sound. It makes me feel bad for these things. I feel kind of bad for them. I'm level two. Let's level up. Sorry. Now we have something in here. So provisions, weapons, ingredients, booster shoots. Herbs that are mainly used to increase potions of special and uh, Ooh, can I make potions? You're telling me I get to make some potions? I wanna fight something else. I oh ee, go away, bitch, go away. You know what? Fine, that's fine. Kid could stop it killing his mom's serial killer right here. <laughs> A rhinosaur? It's gonna take me a bit to get used to like this kind of combat. 
you're dead. You're really ugly, too. I'm sorry. Fucking rhino rat. Um, yeah, I have a bad habit of over-leveling in video games, so... Yeah. Be prepared for that. Damn, you're fast! How do I run fast? How do I run faster in this Let's game? Go. What is that? Jesus Christ! Nice! <laughs> That's a good habit. It is a good habit. I put the game on easy purely because um, I'm just focusing on the story for the most part. I think I'm gonna end up doing two streams today. I think I'm gonna play this and then I'm gonna... And then later tonight, I want to play some Little Witch in the Woods. Is that an early access? Minor Watch bird. This. Really, gig. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So just gave me three experience. Listen, I'm getting money though, so I can't even be mad. Oh, you're gonna see me. That's fine. It's fine. Come on. I want to do magic. I might as well, like, get to fucking level three, right? Like, might as well. One of you is just gonna kill me, I feel. What are you? You look cute from afar. <gasps> you are still cute! Watch this! <laughs> Watch this! I'm gonna get attacked first! Oh, Jesus. Uh, okay. You were, um, a lot weaker than I expected. That didn't give me an experience? Well, that's just not fair. What is that? I want to be able to run faster. What is it? Is that a snake? Ah. Turned around right before I got to it. Oh, it's like a lizard. Or a boros. Pick me up. You're dead. I'm almost there. One more of yes. What are you? Have I faced you? I've already forgotten what I faced and what I haven't. Bartender? Should I heal? Probably. <laughs> nice! The urge to freaking pull up that video every time it says, Nice! I've reached level three. Okay. That's enough lollygagging. Oh, is there another item here? More booster shoots. I just want to be able to run faster. There's something I forgot to tell you. What's that, Mr. Drippy? Here in my world, you can use the right analog to change your viewpoint. If you're having any trouble with the controls, go to settings in your main menu, have a fiddle with them. You switch vibration on and off. Speaking pressing, I'd have it on. Rumble, I'll just stay in a rumble with that a little bit of rumble, eh? Now I know this is a lot to take in, Ollie boy, but I'm sure you'll get used to it. 
I guess. I guess. Ding dong Dell. Is that a cat helmet? Looks to me like a classic case of broken heartedness. Broken heartedness? You mean that thing you were talking about before? That's right. The broken hearted are people who've had part of their hearts stolen. Poor souls just uh, aren't themselves. Go all weird and useless, uh, they do. So his heart was broken uh, by. Keep up, will you? Shadar, innit? If anyone tries to stand up to him or does anything he doesn't like, he breaks their hearts into pieces so they can't put up a fight. Jeepers. Hmm. But if he stays that way, we can't get into Ding Dong Dell. Then you better cure him, ain't it, Ollie boy? It's time to mend your first broken heart. Mend it? But how do I do that? Well, you can't do it just yet. There's a couple things we'll be needing first. But I know an old man who's got just what we need. Proper useful, I am, eh? An old man? What old man? What do you mean, what old man? THE old man. Lives in a wood to the north of here. Proper deep and deeply dark it is. That's why we- that's why they call it the deep dark wood. Makes sense, I guess. So we gotta go back. We have to learn how to mend broken hearts. And we're going where? I will fight anybody who comes to me. Mark my words. Russ! Hello, how are you? We can do this! We can do this! I mean, I hope so. Kid. I just feel bad for attacking the doggies. I love you! Why was I facing the opposite way? <laughs> Bye! I'm literally just smacking these animals with a stick. And they're dying. Like that. Think you can step up to me? Me and my stick? Ha! Hey, hey, only one of you at a time. You have an obsession with Genshin? We can do How much this. money have you put into it? I still have it installed, but I just don't ever play it. I don't know why. I I say that. That's how like 90% of my games are. I have, I have so many games I haven't touched them in a while. Nothing lately? You ain't doing pulls? No pulls? When you first started, you paid like 50? Oh, not bad. How far am I going? All the way up there? All the way! Someone donated 40 so you could pull, so 90? Fuck yeah. Honestly, the pools are fucking addicting. They're addicting to watch, too. I could literally sit here and watch somebody pull for hours. Let's go! I like watching other people gamble. Yet dead. Every now and then I'll open the game just to get free shit. You got the one you wanted? Hell yeah, who did you get? <laughs> You're coming home with me. And she said, damn bitch, okay, came home. Hell yeah. That's the kind of luck I like to see. Watch this! Watch this! I don't know who that is. A five star. Hold up. Let me see. Maybe I do know who that is. Hold up. Wait a minute. Oh! Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. She's really pretty. I don't even remember who I have. Um, I, I haven't spent money on the game yet. I've gotten lucky with free pulls, I think, but I don't remember who I have. <sighs> I 
I'm still in the beginning, too. Of Genshin. Don't think I've finished, like, the first chapter. Have fun with you, Nokuni. I will! Thank you! It's one of your fave games. It's so cute. <laughs> it's so cute. I laughed when the mom died. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. You played one until me. Yeah, I'm sorry. I, I just I had to laugh. Okay, it was just this. It, uh, she didn't have to die if it wasn't for this kid. <laughs> But I, for some reason, it was funny to me. <laughs> you know what? You right. <laughs> mm. I want to touch it. Look at that. It's a waystone. They're useful. A waystone? Yeah. There are these ancient stones. See? You can use them to store a record of your adventures so far. In web places like forests and so on, you can't just plonk yourself on the nearest rock and write your story down. Well, why not? Why not, he says. Give me strength, man. Because they're crawling with horrible beasties, ain't it? They are? That sounds kind of scary. You'll get used to it, man. Just remember, you can't go recording your progress any old wear. Allow me to explain a little more. Touch away stone and your health and magic power will be fully restored. Not bad, eh? That's not all, man. These little beauties will also let you save your progress. Traveler's best friend. Wait, can you not save your progress at any time? Which is why you should stop at every waystone you see and make good use of it. Better safe than sorry. Sure, Mr. Drippy. Tidy, that's what I like to hear. Let's hope you're as good as your word. Righto, next stop, the old man of the woods. Can you not save anywhere? Like, you can. Look at that. There's useful. If you're lucky, you'll be able to use these one day. Some fat. No, I didn't. I didn't. I just run into touch dish. Thank you. Who's in there? Hello? I want to go in a forest that's as pretty as this. Without worrying about like spiders and shit. Oh, that's not possible though. Mans, I can't keep up with you. I'm a child. I got little legs. Wait for me. I'm a horrible person. It's the ticks you want to avoid. Who's there? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Jeepers! Ollie boy, meet old father Oak. You fucking How penguin tree. You are leafing us. Oh, drippy, it's you. And to what do I owe the pleasure? Well, I got a visitor by her from another world, see? And what it is, is, I was wondering if you might lend us a bit of a hand, like. Oh, I should have known. You only ever come to see me when you are in need. Sorry, you at all, ship. You know I'm always very grateful. Hmm. This boy. Ah, spotted it, did you, you bark ship? Well, well. The pure-hearted one. Yes. He who will drive out the darkness. He who shall not be named. And Rippy, you mean to... That's right, your ancient ship. We're off to give Shadar a right royal hiding. You? Why? <laughs> as reckless as ever, I see. My toe hurts for some reason. Very well. You shall have my aid. Thanks. First, we had better give the boy a familiar. <gasps> I get a familiar? Ooh. Oh, ho, ho, yeah. Clean forgot I did. He's right, Dolly boy. It might be a bit early, but I suppose we better teach you how to conjure up familiars, innit? Hell yeah. Familiars? Yeah, familiars. You're in our world. You can magic up little fighting creatures from your heart. See? They're called familiars. Can I have a cat? Go in, the beasties are only gonna get bigger and meaner. So you're gonna need a helping hand, or claw, or beak, or tentacle. Can I really do it? Well, there's only one way to find out. You want to help your mom, don't you? Mom is dead. Sure okay. Well, then, grab your wizard. I have to tell you, but mom's dead. To the page marked form familiar. 
But Mr. Drippy, there's no spell name form familiar here. You what? The boy is correct. Look at his wizard's companion. It would seem that it is missing more than a few of its pages. Really? So does that mean I can't cast a spell? Ho ho ho, I'm not as powerless as all that, young man. Oliver, was it? Let me see now. Form familiar. Ah, oh, yes. A gift from me to you, young Oliver. You can just make pages? It's kind of overpowered. You received a page. Describe the form familiar spell. <gasps> Thank you very much, old father oak. Simply possessing the page for a particular spell is no guarantee that you'll be able to make use of it. Some spells are simply not meant for certain wizards, such as life. Don't worry about that for now, man. Just give form familiar go, will you? Sure thing, Mr. Drippy. <gasps> Summons forth the familiar from the caster's heart to fight beside to fight beside them. I'm telling you, this is a Kingdom Hearts summon. Somehow, some way, I'm going to connect this in Kingdom Hearts. Oh my god! Oh my god! It looks like a different form of Ponyo! That face is Ponyo! <laughs> And the stronger you get, the harder he's gonna hit as well. Let me get his cute. So this is a familiar, huh? <laughs> he's so cute. He'll be coming with us. Indeed, he will, Ollie boy. The more the merrier, ain't it? Here, you'd better give the little fellow a name, eh? I'm gonna name you Ponyo. I'm sorry, but like you're literally just gonna be named Ponyo. Do you look like Ponyo? No. You have the face of Ponyo. But um. It's the name you're gonna be given, and it's the name you're gonna take and be happy with. Oliver, we cannot let you set off into the wild with only that withered wand in your hand. Let me give you some spells to aid you in battle. The first is the restorative incantation known as Healing Touch. Nice. Nice! Tidy, that's the most useful spell there is for a wandering adventure. Cuts, bruises, sprains, gashes, all gone in a jiffy with healing touch. Gee, you make it sound like I'm going to get hurt an awful lot, Mr. Drippy. Next, I give you the gift of the Blazing Inferno. Fireball. Fireball. I was going to say name it Father. <laughs> Can I have one, more than one familiar? I'll name the next one Father. <laughs> Shoots a little fi ball of fire, that one does. Plant-based beasties flip and hate fire. Even old tree face here is scared of fireball. Fireball. Drippy, how dare you? You would never aim such a spell at me, would you, boy? Golly, of course not, old father oak. Calcifer? Now, boy, you can press X at any time to open your spell's menu. While casting a spell like Healing Touch can be used at any time, Fireball is meant primarily for use in battle. That said, the most unexpected of spells can prove incomparably useful given the right set of circumstances. Novel problems call for novel solutions, after all. If you find yourself at something of a loss, I recommend that you go through your magic repertoire. You never know which spell might save the day. I can now use the spells menu. <gasps> Side up, huh? Spoiling for a fight, is it? Better give him what he wants, Ollie boy. Huh? But what do I do? Just look at the way it's looking at him. He'll do it. It's as easy as falling off a log, man. Okay. Look at him. What I want him to do. Here goes. Someone TikTok said the Let's twice personal it. Instagram is giving disbandment. Honestly, like the encore and everything for a moment made me think, mm, is something gonna happen? Because I feel like they've been going all out. Kind of like worried, but I hope not. 
But like so many groups are getting their own personal Instagrams now. So like why would that mean disbandment, you know? First off, you gotta pick who's going to fight out of you and your little friend. We've gone to the trouble of making him, so we'd best give him a go, eh? Select him, will you? Tiny, now let's send him into the fray, shall we? Oh yeah, see that circle in the top left there? That's your fami familiar stamina gauge. What that does is, it shows you how much longer he can fight for, see? The longer you keep him on the go, the shortest stamina gauge will get. When it's empty, that means the poor lad's so tired he can't fight anymore. Tragic, eh? So before that happens, you'll have to call him back for you, back to you for a bit of rest. Um, and there's something else about familiar, so you should know. See this little mark here? That's a sign. Hmm. <laughs> Teeny bobbers. Sort of like a star sign, except there's only four of them. Sun, moon, star, and planet. And like star signs, different ones get on better. You can use that to help you in battle. Next, let's talk about tricks. They're proper powerful abilities and a bit like your spells. Just like spells, they cost MP to use. Here you see the cost written next to them. A barrage of random slashes. But what you've got to remember is that you and your fami familiar share health and magic. Ah. So if a familiar uses a trick or takes a big hit, it's your magic or health that'll suffer. Crikey, this is a long old lesson, eh? Right, let's finish with the top tips, shall we? Your familiar stamina is always going down, so you'll need to swap with him regularly. You can do that any time by pressing LB. Okay. I'm gonna stop talking before I put us both to sleep. It's your turn to sing for your supper. Go on, bye bye. That's a little overpowered. Oh, but didn't even. So it's either you or your familiar. Like, I mean, TXT can basically have their own personal Instagrams, and they're obviously not going to disband anytime soon, so. I wonder when we'll get news, though, about, like, if Twice is going to resign with JYP or not. So now you know how to fight with the familiar, Ollie boy. To be a true contender, you need to learn when to let your familiar loose and when to take control yourself. I'll do my best, Mr. Drippy. Oh, and when he's not fighting, the little fellow can be found taking it easy in the creature cage. In the creature cage, you can shower your faithful familiars with delicious treats. Ah, that's what the treats are for. There's all kind of treats to choose from. Some will improve their abilities, and there are some that can even teach them new tricks. Hey. Feed the little blighters enough of what they fancy, and the bonds of fami familiarity between you will grow, meaning you can boost their abilities even more. Careful not to stuff them too full of sweets, though. They'll only end up getting full up. Adoration and moderation, that's the key. I know. I laughed when I saw her name. <laughs> It's probably a lot to get your head around, but just remember that Creature Cage is where you'll look after your familiars and take it from there. Creature Cage, got it. I promise to look after him real well, Mr. Drippy. Ah, I almost forgot. We had something we wanted to ask you, your truckiness. There's a guard down in Ding Dong Dell, and he's brokenhearted, see? Hmm, brokenhearted, you say. Should our evil spread still further? So you will be needing. That we will, your oaktude. They're as quick you are. You still got it, aren't you? Oh, ho, ho. patience and drippy. Of course I have. Let me see now. Hello. That's my dad. I thought you were going to take a nap. Hmm, I know it's here somewhere. Crikey, you've not gone and lost it, have you? Hmm, lost it? The insolence. I put it away safely among my uppermost branches. It's just a little tangled up there, that's all. Uh, while I seek it out, I have a favor to ask of you. I, I did mention we were in a flippant hurry, didn't I? We haven't got time to go. Mr. Drippy, we should help old Father Oak. He gave us those spells, didn't he? 
Ah, how very refreshing to meet such a responsible and honest young man. Alright, alright, I get that flippant message. Go on, what is it you need us for? Well, it's the guardian of these woods, you see. The guardian, eh? What's up with the old fellow? I'm afraid he has become rather unruly of late, and he is neglecting his duties. Well, 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 that's not good, is it? We'd better help you sort him out then, eh? The guardian? He sounds kind of tough. You're still trying. What's the cat doing? Too right he is. He's way stronger than your average beastie. But you've got a familiar on your side now, then. You'll be fine. And besides, if you're going to take down Shadar, you can't back up a bit of light guardian passion now, can you? Okay, I'll do it. Oh, very kind of you. The guardian can be found in the deepest part of the wood beyond the whispering waterfalls. I wish you luck. The tree just looks like a penguin to me. First spells, now familiars. You're turning into a proper wizard, ain't it, Ollie boy? Guess I am, huh? Now then, why don't you take a closer look at your new mate? Uh, how do I do that, Mr. Drippy? It's a piece of cake. Now listen up. If you look on the main menu, you'll see friends and familiars. Sleeping. That's where you'll find all sorts of details about you and your familiar's abilities. Looks a bit complicated and there's a fair few options kicking about in there to be fair, but you'll soon get the hang of it. Now, you're still new to this wizarding lark, so there's a limit to what you can do. But keep fighting monsters and eventually you'll get stronger. We call that leveling up, see? You'll probably make some new mates before long and all. So be sure to take a closer look at them like I showed you. You got it, Mr. Drippy. All right, let me look at the menu. Friends and familiar. Hmm. Hmm, I can give you equipment. 15 experience to level up. <laughs> the sound it's making. So... At level 10. Can I not stand last? Okay. Alrighty. I don't have any treats to give you though. Sorry. Sorry. Okay, so we have to go back. I guess. I don't know if we have to go back or to the other spot. That's the way out of the woods. Wait, where did I pass the thingy? No, I didn't. Well, I guess I can't really save right now. It doesn't want me to. Treasure! <gasps> More white bread. Holly, I'm going to play the little witch in the woods later. I'm excited. Whispering waterfalls after nine? Yeah. I might s like 11. I might start at 11. Hi, right, best one, Yolly boy. It's absolutely crawling with monsters beyond here. Careful you don't get got before you even get to the guardian, eh? You'll be done by then. Yeah. I'll be fine, Mr. Trippy. I have a familiar to help me now. You're as brave you are. Don't forget, though. If the going gets tough, don't be afraid to cast Healing Touch. I sure won't. I remember what old Tree Face told you. The spells menu is a mere tap of X away. You should try to familiarize yourself with the main menu, too, while you're at it. Don't worry. You're not going to break anything no matter what you press. So have a good old poke around. When you learn new skills and all that, new options will come up in the main menu, so keep your eyes peeled to make the most of your new toys. Jeepers, there's so much to remember. You'll soon get used to it all, no worries. Just past the Whispering Waterfalls and on to the Guardian of the Woods we go. Sam, hello, how are you? Good morning. Let's go get it back to normal. Is the music of, like, fine volume for y'all, or... 
Is it too loud? <gasps> Fireball. I don't like the camera going up. I'm good. Reminds you of Star Wars? Mmm, you're right. Are you at work? A whippersnapper and a jabber. Alright, let's use Ponyo. You're dead. Done so. See that? Nice. You've been playing Fallen Order lately? Are you liking it? I don't know if I've played any Star Wars games. Maybe when I was a kid, but... I do not know. Um, I think growing up, I I remember watching Star Wars movies and I liked them. But then after a bar of chocolate, then after that it was kind of like... Eh? I want to sneak up on you! You work from home, still so like chilling in your super cool office? Heck yeah! Loving it, but it's frustrating, but good. Fireball! I don't know if it'll work on you, but let's see. Fireball. Stupid of healing. Oh, old mate's throwing magic out here. <laughs> what are you, a Dungeons and Dragons wizard? Just cast fireball all the time? Heck yeah! Fireball everything! Set the world on fire! Set the world on fire. Um, let's heal ourselves. Hello, hello, how are you? Yeah. You have more health than I thought you would. I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Playing some Nino Kuni for the first time. It's really cute. <gasps> Level up! I'm level four. Mm. See, the thing about me playing games like this is that I feel like I need to explore every single nook and cranny sometimes. And I get distracted. Yeah, this is the first one. Let's do it. Let's do it! Fireball! Oh. <laughs> amazing game, long but amazing. Everyone that has said that they've played this game said that they've loved it. Like, I have not heard anything bad about it. it makes me happy. Cranky, I knew there's something I forgot to tell you about familiars. Huh? What's that? This is important, Ollie boy, so listen carefully, alright? Should you hire your familiars can use tricks, didn't I? Well, if the little fellows get stronger, they'll start learning new ones. If you want to see what tricks your familiars have up their sleeves, choose friends and familiars from the main video. Tricks are a bit different from magic. Each individual trick fills a single command slot, you see? Press Y when you're in a friend's familiar bit, and you can change the command slots used for tricks. Which reminds me, I feel like I can only remember a maximum of eight tricks at any given time. 
Meaning if you want them to learn a new one, you'll have to make them forget one of their old ones. Bit of a pain, like, but at least you can teach an old familiar new tricks. Anyway, the important thing is that you assign a trick to your familiar's command wheel. If you don't, you won't be able to use it. Simple as that. Okay. Thanks. I appreciate it. A treasure. I love Drippy. The beginning of this game made me laugh, too. I feel bad for laughing, but it, it made me laugh. You can see me from all the way over there? Jesus. We can do this. We can do this. Mm, fireball. Fireball. Goodbye. I need to go up the other path, too. I'm gonna fight you! Hurricane wizards. What's this to me playing on PC? Yeah, playing on PC. Let's go. Nice! You're dead, Dunzo. Goodbye. I've been thinking about buying Xenoblade for my Switch too. Um just to play. I don't know if I'd stream it or anything, but just to play. I wanna go up here to I want to see all the things, alright. Oh. You literally just backhanded smack this little thing. <sighs> Said not today. Level up, spring water. Thanks. Thanks. Um, was I going this way? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Treasure chest right there, and it's like this little pathway up here. Haven't picked up my switch in months. I should really. I really should because then I can finish Hades and Pokemon Shield. Yeah, I have. Um, actually, I picked it up recently. Haha. -ha. Iced coffee. Uh, I bought this game called Turnip Boy Commits Tax Fraud because it was like on sale for the Switch. Let's go! Um. I like the game, but uh, on Switch, it's just, it stutters, and that's my only issue with it so far. I'm still like early, early game, but I'm still stuck on November 28th for Animal Crossing because I was villager hunting, so I literally cannot play Animal Crossing until I go back to November 28th, and then, you know. Need to put myself on a one game at a time roll? I don't know what that is. <laughs> That's impossible. That's everything here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. A save! Thanks! An avocado! Thanks! Will I be able to defeat this dude? Hold up, Ollie boy. Huh? What is it? Listen, man. Someone's coming. But I don't. It's him. It's the flipping guardian. Oh, God. Don't step on it. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Oh, he just got smacked. <laughs> Guardian of the Woods. Alright. Ow! Ow! I just tried moving my freaking mic stand, except I, like, 
hurt my finger instead. Ow. I didn't mean to do that. Hold up. Before I start this, let me get some more water. Considering getting Assassin's Creed Rebels bundle for Switch, mainly for something to do on your up-and-coming long-ass flights. Do it. Do it. Leela's been uh, sleeping above the dishwasher because I don't know. Flying to Canada is going to take a long ass time. <gasps> what you going to Canada for, if you don't mind me asking? Um. Me. Fireball. More firebomb. Yeah. You best defend yourself. You've seen the defend command. Use it or you're in for a proper headache. All right. Nice. Meeting your partner's family? That sounds exciting. Are you nervous? Defending against big moves like that can earn you a nice little bonus as well. My finger hurts now. So when he starts building up a nasty looking number, be sure to put up your guard. Fireball. I'm gonna die. Yeah, fireball. Nice. I didn't. Very nervous, but also excited. I'm excited for you. When do you go? Chance! Look, all the boy the big lumps only gone and knackered himself. Now, now is your chance to give him a proper walloping. All right. July. Wow. I didn't pay attention to what he said before. Not only that, it lets you a miracle move that doesn't use any. They don't hang around forever. Hurry up and grab it. Oh, this thing. Oh, wait. No, that thing. This. Burning heart. Ooh. Ooh. That's cool. Spirit of the Woods. Ooh, can I use you as a familiar? Now that's a fireball, right? Ponya learned Sandblast. He obtained a page describing the Guardian of the Woods. Can I use you? <laughs> Bye! Crikey, that was a close run thing. The Guardian... He headed towards the deepest part of the wood. Do you think he's back to normal now? Your guess is as good as mine, but that weird look in his eyes is gone at least. I reckon it'll probably take some time to get out his head to get or time out to get his head together and then it'll be right back to the old gardening. What made him go all screwy like that? You don't think it was Of course it flippin' was. That should have written all over it. We'd best watch your backs if we visit any more forests. Saying that, you get guardians everywhere. Anyway, we did what we came to do. We best get back to see old tree face, eh? Sure, let's go. Serenity of the Guardian 
Serenity of the Guardian of the Woods Heart has unlocked a story in the Wizard's Companion. Mm, a new tale of wonder. Let's look at it. Hmm. Oh. You did well to calm the Guardian of the Woods. And I found what I was looking for. But first, a gift. My way of thanks. Gee, you are I like gifts. I entrust to you one of my closest companions, the Telling Stone. His knowledge of our world rivals even my own. I thought he might help you on your journey. I'm sure if you ask him nicely, he will tell you anything you wish to know. Hmm. And the other thing, the locket. This is what you came here for, is it not? It is a vessel for fragments of the human heart. To rescue the heartbroken, you will need the locket and the spells required to use it. Okay. I will give you those as well. Thank you so much, old Father Oak. Hmm. Such a well-mannered child. This person's right, voice so is right. familiar. What? I, oh, all right, all right. Ta, Buckface. Hmm. Some things are as unchanging as the forest. No matter. You had best be on your way. Now, boy, you must come and see me from time to time and tell me of your travels. Okay. I look forward to hearing of your progress. That's easy. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Let's be off, shall we? Time to head back to Ding Dong Dell and mend a broken heart. <laughs> Yeah, I don't like the way this rock's looking at me. Telling stone is now accessible from the main menu. Unlock it. Take heart spell. And give heart spell. Hmm, we're taking hearts. Hold up. I want to see, like, who this voice actor is. Because his voice is very familiar to me. I think. I think. Adam Wilson? I don't know who that is. Mm -hmm. They're in nothing that I've watched. Okay. Well, figured I'd look it up just in case. And I don't know who they are. Life lessons. Okay, so this is just a. All right. Ooh, a progress report. I'm not. I'm not gonna 100% this game, but I like that. Dangerous places. The deep dark wood. Ooh, percentage explored. 100%. Oh fuck yeah! It tells me what's there. I do like that. I do like that. Pieces of heart you've gathered. Read from the beginning. This is... Why is this so zoomed in? Zoom out. No, zoom out. No, zoom out! Sweet baby Jesus. Where's... You got a meeting? Have fun with your meeting! Did I not press Y? <laughs> Sweet, milky drink and gentle coffee flavor. Restores 10 MP and these restore health. Okay, cool. Cool beans. Thank you, Mr. Tree. I appreciate it. I'm almost convinced that this controller has drift. Maybe it doesn't. Maybe I'm crazy. I could very much be crazy. I mean, it's not doing anything right now. Shh. 
should it be doing that? I genuinely don't know if it should be doing that or not. No, I think it's fine. Maybe. I can't see where I'm going. Wow, that person didn't want to fight me, the bird? You did. You missed me. Ha! <laughs> Watch this! Here goes! Oh! Jesus! One hit KO now! Get on my level! I had to remember which way I needed to go. We can do this. Here go. Drowsy drops. You missed. I'm interested to see what other familiars I can have. Um, which way am I going? Okay. I can go this way. Oh yeah, yeah. I see the I see the town now. Yeah, yeah. Come at me. You're gonna die instantly. We can do this. Think you can step up to me? Get in my face? Yeah, yeah. That's what I thought. So, are we gonna be... My question is, is the game only gonna be in this world? Come on. Certainly not, right? If we have gateway. Hello, Ouroboros! Ouroboros! Let's do it! You know what? I'll be myself. And fireball. <laughs> I would like to set everything on fire, please. Please and thank you. Hey, we're almost at 200 gold. I'd like to think that we're just a little bit rich uh, for a child. Okay. 200 bucks to a child is a lot. Am I, like, is nobody back home wondering where this kid is? Oh my god, what? It's official. Looks like he's still the worse for wear, huh? We're getting a Starbucks? Nice. We have to help him. Right though, Ollie boy. I better explain how it's done then, innit? First thing you'll need to do is to take the locket Treeface gave you and fill it with the piece of heart our friend is missing. Uh, the piece of heart? That's right. One of the bits we're all made up of deep down. The bits we're made up of? I don't understand. Mm, how can I put it? Ah, just give it a go. You'll soon work it out, man. First off, what that guard's missing is a drop of good old-fashioned enthusiasm. Uh, Find some and give it to him, and he'll be right as rain. Okay, but where do I find enthusiasm? Well, now, feast your eyes on that other guard but there. He's got more get-up-and-go than a sack of squirrels. If he hasn't got some enthusiasm to spare, I'm a monkey's uncle. Ask nicely, and I'm sure you mm, So that's the take heart. Okay. Sure, I'll try my best.
So do I just take heart? Nothing happens? Wait. Um, excuse me, sir. I wonder if you could just could do us a favor. I wish I could. I really do. But I'm afraid I can't open this gate without my colleague's permission. Oh, no, it's not that. We just want to borrow some of your enthusiasm. <laughs> well, if it's enthusiasm you're after, I've got plenty to spare. Take as much as you want. Thank you, sir. Uh, Mr. Derpy, how do I get the enthusiasm out of his, uh, heart? Look at the pages old Trueface gave you for your book. There's a spell called Take Heart you need to cast first. Take Heart, huh? Okay, yeah, so Take Heart. I don't know, what if that's too much enthusiasm? Tidy! Looks like you got yourself a locket full of enthusiasm! Now, you just gotta give it to our friend over by there! Okay, here goes. And then you go over. Spell you'll need to this time is give heart. I know it sounds just like the other one, but don't get them mixed up, whatever you do. Don't worry, Mr. Drippy, give heart is the one for repairing broken hearts. I'll remember that. Now, when you cast give heart, you'll need to choose the piece of heart you want to restore from your locket. Of course, you only got one in there at the moment, so even you can't mess this up. Go on then, give that guard his enthusiasm back. Alright, here goes. Okay. Beautiful! It worked! Neato! Uh, tidy. Looks like he's back in the land I didn't of the care living. that much about Starbucks while finally growing. I mean, What's that's happening? really good. Where am I? Well, well, well. It's the start of more us, businesses. Yes, I, I feel so strange. As if a weight has been lifted from my heart. I feel better. <laughs> Thank goodness for that. I was worried about you. I'm sorry. I wasn't myself. But I'm back now. And ready to work harder than ever. Well then, these fine people have all come to visit our great kingdom. Hydrate, I just took some a drink of water too. Indeed we had. <laughs> this way, everybody. This way, everybody. I can't thank you enough, but I'm sure you'll receive a fair share of merit stamps for performing such a heroic feat. Merit stamps? What are those? You mean you helped me without even thinking of the merit stamps you'd earned? You do have a merit stamp card, don't you? They're used to collect stamps or order for helping those in need. If you don't have one, you should visit Swift Solutions in town and pick one up. Listen to me rabbiting on. I have to get this gate open. That's what you're waiting for, isn't it? Yes, please, sir. Tidy, we finally go inside. Open the gates! Ding dong dealt the Cat King's castle, so it is kitties! I thought so with that helmet. Alright, before I continue though, let me just... We're back. Let me open this drink. Did y'all hydrate? Did you do some stretchy stretches? Welcome back. Thanks! Welcome back to YouTube. Congrats, everyone. You did it. I want to get a, like, footrest to put under my desk. I think I'm also going to uh, restart my ring fit stuff. Um, my alarm has been going off on the Switch every single day ever since I bought ring fit, and I've been ignoring it every single day for a while. <laughs> I think I might restart it. You have a cooler as a footrest? Nice. Indeed we are, Ollie boy. There are a few unseen snags on the way, I'll admit. But all's well that ends well. And I was gonna take you to see old tree face eventually anyway. Righto, on with the wand hunt. The king of this place knows a spell or two. Let's see if it can help us, shall we? A real life king? Sure. I guess that means we should head for that big old palace over there, huh? <gasps> There's one of these things. I guess it's a fast travel. Hello! Why are you just like staring at a tree? Yay! Pee pee time! Oh. <laughs> oh! 
That's uh, <laughs> that's why you're staring at the trees. <gasps> Jeep, hello. It's going well. I just defeated the guardian of the woods. And now I'm in the cat palace. Which I'm excited about because cats. How are you? I just wanted to explore. Nice. God, I just love the cutscene so much. It's so different. Stop staring, man. It's rude. But look at those goofy clothes. Goofy? Bitch, they're wearing the same thing as you. Huh? Cranky, we better get you a new outfit before they put you in the zoo. Come on, Ollie boy. Uh, okay. Ooh, I bought a cute outfit. I'm sorry, Ollie boy, but no matter how trendy they are no over in Motorville, your clothes are just plain out of place if I over here. Are they really so strange? But this is all I have. Then we'll just have to buy you some more, won't we? There's loads of shops here in Ding Dong Dell. One of them must sell clothes. <gasps> Welcome back! What kind of foods did you make? I guess. Okay, let's go find a store where I can buy a new outfit. What kind of food? What's on the menu? <laughs> uh oh, here's trouble. It's Irish. <gasps> Flatas? Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god, look at this sweet old lady. She looks like an owl. Look at her. <gasps> I just want to protect this old lady. Hey, can I can I steal your chest? Excuse me, ma'am. Do you sell clothes from this uh I mean, do you sell regular clothes? Clothes <laughs> Hoot Nanny! Her name is Hoot Nanny! <laughs> Clothes, dear. Oh, hoot. I'm afraid we don't have any in stock at the moment. Don't tell us that. Have you seen how the boy's dressed? He's a flippin' embarrassment. Need more coffee? That work meeting sucked the life out of me? Oh, no. He's getting funny looks wherever we go. My street cred is in ruins. Oh, fairy. I used to see you kind all the time, but I'll bet children these days don't even know who you are. You're telling me, kids these days, disrespectful, ignorant, downright rude, where's the lie? They wouldn't know a fairy if it kicked them in the flippin' shins. Not like you, eh, missus? How about these clothes? Yes, dear. Hmm, let me know. Now, let me think now. Ah, now I come to think of it, there was a traveler who left a set of clothes here once upon a time. He'd bought a new outfit, you see, so he's left his old one behind. Love you, Holly, have fun! Roughly human shaped, is it? And cheap? I shouldn't doubt. Tidy. We'll take it. But Mr. Drippy. Yes, yes. Now I remember. He was the one who. Yes, he said they were very special clothes. Made from fabric woven from the fibers of the sky tree, if I remember rightly. Lovely and comfy. Extremely hard wearing and lucky to hoot. I think the only problem would be the size. If it's you who are going to wear this outfit, dear, I'll need a few hours to make some alterations. It would look huge on you otherwise. Could you come back tomorrow morning? Of course we can. How about, how's about that then, Ollie boy? There's Lucky. Nito, thank you very much, ma'am. <laughs> Pleasure, my dear. Toodaloo for now. Until tomorrow. I love her. I love her. Protect her. Tomorrow's flipping ages away. I'd like to go and see the king right away, but we can't go until we got your outfit sorted. Eh? Guess not, but what will we do until tomorrow? I know. That guard on the gate said something about us getting some kind of card from a place in town. Something Solutions, I think he said the name of the shop was. The one we just went in, the boutique, that's the owl one. Was it a uh, Swift Solutions? There's Clever You, that's the one. I knew it was some other kind of bird. Nice one, Ollie boy. Are they all bird named? <gasps> a cat! Shut up, Drippy! I want to go say hi to the cat! You reckon? They're just named after what they look like. Anyway, let's get over to Swift Solutions, shall we? The cat! Let me talk to the cat! <laughs> what a lovely outfit. Your shirt is such a pretty shade of yellow. <laughs> look at him! Look at him! I want to be a cat. 
<gasps> Did you just meow? <sighs> hey, you got anything back here? Are you peeing again? Shop that looks like an owl. It's called the boutique. I wonder why they chose that name. Cat should be main character. Agreed. Agreed. Hey, any treasure? I don't know why I'm looking for treasure. Did you just do a barrel roll, my guy? Hey, anything in there? This is the best spot for a breather and all a ding dong dial. Why don't you join me for a bit? Visit Swift Solutions. Birds! Swift Solutions is back the other way, but there's a save over here too. A bigger cat! You know the pots we've been dotted all over town? Well, you should probably have a look inside them every now and then again. Guess it's time for some Mountain Dew. <laughs> Bob last. You never know when you might find something interesting. Or plain purr. Purr. <gasps> Another cat! Tug a tail turning is starting soon. I've got to stop. Start practicing. Oh, yep. I love this place. Yep. So cute. I think I might purchase some nice new clothes. <laughs> the ba ha 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 blast. <laughs> Hello, I would like to save. I like saving. Otherwise, I'm gonna forget. Ooh. Oh my god, I just realized the pots are cat shaped. <gasps> Pie? Uh, why y'all sticking? Oh, how pretty. Why are y'all sticking pie in pots? Pot pie? Oh, I can't save here. I don't know why I thought I could save here. It's just a. Uh, hello. Eh? Well, what's up with you, man? Look up a pail, you do. Huh? You're giving this to me? You received a page describing the spirit and medium spell. Well, fancy that. That's a page from the wizard's companion, that is. What's this little squirt doing with it? I'm sorry, I can't hear you. Do you think he can't speak? Nah, that's not him. I don't know if I'm not very much mistaken. Yep, must be. Hmm, did you figure something out, Mr. Trippy? That spell he just gave you. Give it a try, Ollie boy. You'll soon see. Well, all right then. You have some Baja Blast right now? Some Baja Blast? <laughs> Thank goodness it worked. Cheapers, creepers, you can talk. Of course I can talk, silly. You cast spirit medium on me, didn't you? So that's what it does, huh? You mean to tell me you cast a spell without knowing what it did? What kind of wizard are you? For future reference, spirit medium lets you speak to the spooky spirits of the dead, like me. So I was right. You're a flipping ghost, aren't you? Uh, 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 ghost? Jeepers. You mean to tell me the ghosts really exist? Bitch, you've been looking at one since the beginning of this game. Of course they do. Wizards see them all the time. I was a wizard too once, you know. But thanks to that idiot, the dark djinn, there aren't too many wizards left. So when I saw you, I thought I'd better hand the page over. You're the first wizard I've seen in I don't know how long. Jeepers, can I really keep it? Of course. It's the least I can do to say thanks for looking after my book. Your book? Ah, uh, you got your wires crossed, sunshine. That's our book, that is. Who are you anyway? Me? I'm Morris. Although you probably know me better as the Sage of Ages. Hang on a sec. You want us to believe a little midget like you is a sage of flipping ages? Who are you calling a midget, pipsqueak? True. True. I'm a fairy. I'm supposed to be the size, cheeky little. You're called Ollie, aren't you? And you're on a journey in, in our world? Uh, yeah. Hmm, maybe I'll go on a little journey myself. I haven't taken a look around our world for a long time. Alright. I'm heading south to the desert. Hopefully we'll meet again in the town down there. See you soon. Bye! Thanks for the page. Glad I came over here. I thought it was a safe point, but it's not. Glad I came over. Yeah, I, honestly, I'm not the biggest fan of Baja Blast, but, like, I'm also not the biggest fan of Taco Bell. I almost thought about trying the alcoholic Taco Bell, the, the Baja Blast, at the Taco Bell in Vegas, though. I almost thought about it. <gasps> What's in here? 
Poison be gone. Thanks, that's useful. I got a text. It says... <laughs> it's... I got a text from CVS. It says, Shasina, May is Mental Health Awareness Month. <laughs> Visit CVS. Speak with your provider. Seek care from a trusted source. Um... <laughs> Are you trying to tell me something? Are you trying to tell me I need therapy? <laughs> Hi, Neptune. How are you? Taco Bell cantinas are amazing. Are they really? Where else are there Taco Bell cantinas? Wait. I'm going to Google this now. Is it just Vegas? No, there's some in Texas? Orange or Cantinas? What? Wait, we have one here? No way. Wait a minute. Interesting. Yeah, uh, low-key kind of wanna... Like, John and I don't drink alcohol. We just don't. But low-key kind of want to go there. To try it out, you know? Interesting. Can you take the alcohol outside? I know that's a dumb question, but, you know, some places don't allow you to take it, like, outside. Like... Interesting. It's actually not that far from us. I don't wow, you're telling me it's... <gasps> Wait a minute. I've been that close to a fucking Taco Bell cantina. <laughs> like, I've driven close to it. Wow. Had one in San Francisco? Really? There's one here I just noticed about a week ago? Really? so interesting listen if i if i end up going i'll let you guys know i don't i don't like that this is automatically moving up i don't know if that's the game or if it's my controller um it, how can i check Hold up. I'm sorry, you guys. How can I check controller shit in Steam? Settings? Controller? I'm gonna do a whole fucking calibration. Hold up. Push the left joy click oh oh my god oh yeah i have dr major drift on the right analog stick on this yep that's what it is. I fucking knew it. I knew something was off. It's so bad. Are we drag racing? Yes. It's so bad. How do I fix that? You know, this is a fairly new controller, too. No wonder. Hmm. Hold up. It doesn't really matter. I'll fix it later. I'm gonna go. Where is it telling me to go? Did I pass it? Is it over here? 
What have I missed? Um, we talked about Taco Bell Cantina. Um, Baja Blast alcohol. And also, my Xbox controller has drift on it, and it's a fairly new controller. So, that's cool. That's up there. Swift solutions for people. Go to ask for help or something. <laughs> Listen, I just saw Sparkly. I'm sorry. The fuck is Taco Bell Cantina? It's Taco Bell with alcohol. It's a fancy Taco Bell, basically. <gasps> More. See, this is what happens in video games. I get <gasps> very distracted. How do you get down there? I see shiny and I'm like, ooh! Oh, Jesus. He freaked me out for a moment there. There's nothing over here. This is a good game to be distracted in. This is a beautiful world to me. So I don't mind being distracted in it. Talk about here just sells booze anyways. Yeah, but America, you know. <laughs> America. Welcome to Swift Solutions, where those in need come to watch their worries fly away. And where those who are feeling helpful agree to perform tasks on their behalf. You live in the land of backwards shit, exactly. <laughs> what sort of tasks do you mean, sir? You honestly don't know? Dear me, you really are new to this. Aren't you? Well, I shall swallow my amazement and explain. Like you can see the controller drifting on its own. Oh, folks who are in need of assistance flock to me, hoping to find someone willing to take on their errands for them. On your travels, you're bound to run into people who are looking for help. And you'll have to decide whether or not to soothe their fluttering hearts by taking on the tasks they set to you. Have a look at the errand board over there. On it, you will see a list of the tasks you can take on. At Swift Solutions, you can also agree to undertake missions to eliminate specific monsters. These are known as bounty hunts. If you want to find out more, access the main menu and take a look in your journal. My journal, huh? Okay, I think I got it. Your journal will also show you how many merit stamp cards you've got. Oh, the gatekeeper mentioned something about those. I uh, don't think I have one though. Oh, you don't, do you? Well, that is swiftly remedied. Keep this merit stamp card safe. You'll need it to collect stamps when you complete tasks. Once you've filled up a few cards, you can exchange them for merit awards, which are sure to be useful on your travels. Simply visit the nearest branch of Swift Solutions, hand over your completed cards, and the award will be yours. Okay, thank you very much, sir. Wow, helping people out is all part of saving the world, Ollie boy. But before we make a start on all that do-goodery, we need to get you dressed for the job. Now, the hoot and nanny said your outfit will be ready tomorrow. So I reckon our best plan of action is to go and get a good night's sleep down at the cat's cradle. Journal is now accessible! New errand sound venom. A gremlin standing near the hootique and ding dong dell looks somewhat troubled. Sure, can I take them all? Like, can I just... Grimlkin near the... Cottermaster's... Cottermaster's store in Ding Dong Dell? Ding Dong Dell mother looks like she's worried about something. Ah, so these are the awards. Allow you to jump by pressing B while running. Allow you to... Ooh, run a little faster! Yes, that's what I need! Yes! It's literally what I wanted. I'm not a fan of moving slowly in video games. <laughs> I want to go in there. Goodness me, where have the little rascals run off to now? Is something the matter, ma'am? It's my boys. Three of them are forever running off and not coming back. I know they're just playing, but I can't help thinking they'll hurt themselves. You worry about them a lot, huh? Yes, I do. And today, they're even later than ever. I'm beside myself. Ah, mother's life is never easy no matter where you go, eh? You don't have a spare moment, do you? Could you go and find my boys for me? Yes, I can. 
Sorry to put you to such trouble, but if you could let me know when you found them, I'd be ever so grateful. Damn it, I was hoping I could get to that. Hello there, young man. Some fresh fruit. You like jazz? Are you still peeing? You're still peeing. I know Cat's Cradle's right there, but I don't want to sleep yet. Look at this place. What a glorious day. I wish I could take a minute just to lay on the grass. I mean, you're literally just standing there. You could take a minute to lay on the grass. King Tom used to come and play with me and my friends all the time, but he hasn't come out of his castle for ages now. It's really boring without him. Any sparklies? <gasps> Sparkly? I'm gonna be a cat person. Oh, it's just. Do I actually need to. Oh, oh, I should have. I thought it was just gonna be random talking. Oh, that's my bad. Um, I wasn't paying attention to. to Bring me two planes worth flowers and two bottles of spring water. Um, now the kid. I know. I know I have like one of those twinkling spots on the ground outside town. Be sure to investigate them when you stumble upon. It. Okay, okay. Once you forage from a particular spot, it won't twinkle as it did before. But never fear, both its produce and its twinkle will return in time. Got it. Thank you, ma'am. Okay, but wrong button. I have three of those. I need one more spring water. That's what it is. And I don't even remember how I got the first spring water. <laughs> What's this place? The sewers? There's no children around here. Yeah, I'm really bad with side quests. You know, I still have not finished um, my playthrough of Final Fantasy VII Remake. Yeah. You want to know why? Because I get distracted. I get distracted real easy. It's a problem. Here, there's... <laughs> No, children? Paradise. <laughs> My precious treasure, you see. I can't remember which pot I hid it in. Gee, that's tough. What sort of treasure is it? I've done it on both difficulties. Yeah, um, I just started that a couple weeks ago and I stopped too. I, you know, I restarted the playthrough on PS5 and it's just, I... I typically sit down at my PC... And not at the couch. And then I end up playing a game on my PC. I really should, though. <laughs> Meow. It's a problem. I know. My goal is to finish it before <laughs> hook up the P PS5 and the PC monitor or buy it on PC. See, I could do that. I could do that. But at the same time, I like playing it on my 4K TV. <laughs> I'm saying that I've got like 500 PC games that I haven't finished. Yeah, you know. Yeah, you know. <laughs> Shit happens. No, you know what? That's that. My goal is to finish it before the next part comes out. If I if I don't, I'll be very sad. Where are these children? Oh, oh God! It's a. Did I tell you the story about your third screen? No. 
Aw, oh, look. Poor Dab's gone and hurt himself. Must be one of those ladies' lost boys. We better patch him up, eh? Jeepers, that looks painful. But what can we do, Mr. Trippy? We don't have a first aid kit. Cracky, Ollie boy. Brain like a flippin' sea if you've got. You're a wizard, Harry. <laughs> use some flippin' magic. Oh, uh, sure. What do I... Which spell do I use, Mr. Trippy? For crying out loud, I'm telling you this once, right? Healing touch. Got it? Healing flippin' touch! You said it twice. Oh, shut up, kid. Hmm? Doesn't hurt anymore. Hooray, I'm all better. Listen, sunshine, your poor mother's worried sick about you, right? Get on home with you. I will, I promise. Thank you for making me better. You're welcome, child. Figured I'd look over here in case there be another kid. It's just this boy. I think we're gonna make spaghetti for Din Din. The thing that I'm bad at is knowing how much spaghetti to put in the pot to boil. It's either I don't put enough or I put too much. Started flickering and cutting itself out, so I went and bought a new screen. Get it home and it works fine for like four hours and starts freaking the fuck out again. Oh no. Was it you that I... My oh my. You've got it. You got my earring. Oh, that's perfect. Just perfect. You found it for me. We sure did. Don't lose it again now, okay? I promise. I'll never lose it again. Oh, here. This is a present for you. Thank you so much. Leafy mantle. <gasps> Errand complete. Yay! Oh, I wanted to use whatever the thing was. Yeah, how do I use this? Can I not use it yet? Turns out it was the fucking HDMI cable. No. Oh, no. That's unfortunate. <laughs> That's the legend eighty dollars you didn't have to spend. I didn't see a kid over here. Is there a kid over here? Oh, you can't jump that. So if I need to break him out, then set up my old three screen as your fourth? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Am I blind? Like, are these kids just fucking pros at hide and seek or something? Jesus. Isn't there two more? I'm not crazy, right? Yeah, three missing sons. Could they be in buildings? That's a great question. Oh, you look majestic. Oh, yep. They can be in buildings. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> I tripped over my leg. Like, <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. I'm one of those people that laugh at children getting hurt. I'm sorry. Like, if I see a child... <sighs> Somebody tripped in front of me and John and I laughed, but you know, I had, you know, we're wearing masks, so thankfully they can't see that we laughed. Oh, and when we went to Target, this dude in a car, he was parking and he hit the damn handicap thing, the handicap pole. Laughed at that dude, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> not gonna lie. Commiserations, friend. You're the- ah, But I'm not allowed to sell weapons or armor to travelers. You're gonna need special permission from the king. Ah. But can I open the chest? <laughs> or just come in- Oh, a Sunday! Why did you have a Sunday in the chest? I wonder if the other one's gonna be in the, uh, building I need to go into. 
But I'm gonna check over here real quick. The hootin' nanny. The old hootin' nanny. I wanna open this chest. While we're here, might as well check this building. Because you never know. Though they're probably in the building that I'm going to. Good day, sir. I don't know if there's any more buildings in this place. Besides the one that I'm going to. What a cozy little, like, town this would be to live in, though. Hello! Hello! You got a child up in here? Taking your cake. You got no children. Did you do the spiral staircase? There's a spiral staircase? Where's that? We're talking about this fish one? Like this? Oh, I'm gonna be honest with you. I did not fucking know that I could access this. So, thank you because I would- I'm- I'm too blind. <laughs> I was literally looking at it like, oh, this is so cute. Like, I want to go out there and not realize that I could go out there. Your mom wants ya. Go back home or else. Today's a fine day for mouse blacking. The only question is, what to black them with? You look like the kid. Mm. No, not really. I guess this is another one you can open later. Like, could, can you imagine how adorable it would be to live in this house and this is what you, like, wake up to? You just come outside and it's this and you have your own little pond? Like, come on. That's so precious. Thanks, Chief. I didn't want to say when I noticed you looked at it and didn't... Yeah, I literally, like, I didn't notice that the, there were stairs and I looked at it from this angle. But I thought that it was just, like... In, in the build, like in the wall. <laughs> Thank you so much for finding all three of my boys. And you patched the little rascals up as well. You're a treasure. An absolute treasure. I'm just glad we could help. Oh, I can't wait till they grow up a little and calm down. Here, this is to say thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <gasps> three slices of pie? Mmm. But there's a child there. No, we, we removed the child. Pond will be cooler if I had fishies. Agreed. Fishies are a must for a pond. Yes. Cinder has, is saying hello again. She's come up to me. <gasps> Three merit stamps. Dun, 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 dun. This one gives you two. Um, can I give you treats? <gasps> Magical attack increase accuracy evasion. Magical defense. Um, you know what? We'll give you this. <laughs> it's so cute! Oh my god. We'll give you one of these. Shit, I think I want this game now. <laughs> it's so fucking cute. Pyom 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 pyom. My cat's doing something that she shouldn't. Ninja Flippy, thank you so much for subbing for 54 months. Thank you. How are you doing? 
Whoa. Um. Does it tell me where I can get certain items? Spring water. Does the game tell me? That's creatures. It would just be out outside, right? I want to get new clothes. Excuse me. I want to look like a whiz -waz. Has my heart attack over price tag on Steam. See if it's on sale. Uh, here, let me see. Look up to one of the cat. One of the cats. Cradles chain of premium ends. We pride ourselves on our practicality and pricing. Ten guilders. Your custom is always appreciated. Mm, oh, you look a little unusual. Your traveler eye. Zoom. Hello, Cinder. Then I encourage you to take a nap at each of our inns, wherever your travels may take you. We're very proud of our deep and comfortable beds, and we hope you enjoy them as much as we do. Thank you very much. Huh? Look at your wizard's companion. There's something different about it. Ah, there's useful. The memories of all the travelers who stayed here have filled it back up a bit. Gee, I never expected that. Cinder's walking back and forth. At some point, she's going to step on my keyboard. Why the heck not, man? It's a flippin' mighty spell book, ain't it? We'd best stay at as many of these places as we can. Ninja, how are you doing? I guess so, huh? Yeah, I was gonna say, it, it might be on sale in like CD Keys or GOG or even Humble Bundle. The Summerlands. Cinderella. Baby girl. Baby girl. What are you doing? I wish you could hear her purr, but she doesn't purr very loudly. <gasps> Oliver, huh? Mother? Mom? Mom! You've done so well to make it this far. Oliver. She did. Mom? Is this a dream? Cinder, can you please sit down? You must listen I can't to me, see Oliver. the screen. You have to go to him. To face him. Huh? And when you do. Who's him? Learn the truth. Promise me, no matter how hard it is. Him? Mom, who's him? Mom, what do you mean? Oh God, Someone Cinder, she almost... Oh, she oh, made my heart us. stop for a moment. But who is he? <laughs> she, where do I have to go? <laughs> she's like... <laughs> oh, that was so confusing. I heard music. It's my alarm. Uh, <laughs> She freaking is rubbing her bonking her head on the mic, right? And I'm just sitting in my chair like a fucking shrimp, okay? I, I fixed my posture now, but I was sitting in my chair like a damn shrimp, literally. <laughs> she goes to bonk her head on the mic and almost slips off the side of the desk. Gave me a heckin' fright, okay? <laughs> it's all right, sweetie. You're already on your way. Don't give up, Oliver. No matter how hard it gets. Mom? She's floating away! Mom! Mom! She's a demon! <laughs> morning, young man, and what a perfectly fine morning it is, too. You slept well, I hope. Excellent. You'll be right on your way now, I expect. Well, if you happen across another cat's cradle in your travels, be sure to stay with us again. Time is this. See you soon. Right, oh, Ollie boy. Back to the owl ship. I love her hair. I guess it'd be her ears, like, obviously, but, like, just the way that it's done. Mom. Mom. Save your progress? Yes, I would love to. I think I bruised the top of my thumb. Alright, I think that's going to be my stopping point for today. I got to do some final things before John gets off of work. Because he's probably going to... Oh my sweet baby Jesus! My ears! Ha ha ha! <laughs> it just blasted me in the ears. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I accidentally muted myself. Anyways. Um, I am thinking I may be back on later tonight because I really want to play Little Witch in the Woods. I really, really want to play it. So, if y'all 
want to come hang out again later tonight you're more than welcome to if you can't that is fine too i appreciate you thank you so much for being here with me today i'm excited to continue this game what you call in later like Like about six hours from now. Roughly. About six hours from now, I'm going to play some Little Witch in the Woods. And then tomorrow, hopefully do another day stream and play more of this game. Because it's fucking adorable and I love it. But thank you for being here with me. I appreciate you. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day, night, whatever it may be. And I will talk to you later tonight. Goodbye!